Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. And here I have a great article for you guys straight from T-Mobile's newsroom. I'll leave a link to it in the description so you guys can check it out. So T-Mobile achieves record-breaking uplink speeds with another 5G first. So T-Mobile is breaking its own records, apparently. The uncarrier worked with Nokia and Qualcomm to complete a data session leveraging 5G ULTX uplink transmit switching, reaching peak speeds of 345 megabits per second. So this lets you know that T-Mobile has no plans to remove themselves from Nokia. And if you watched my video yesterday, what they're now deploying in my market in Ericsson land, they also have no reason or plans to move away from Ericsson. So it looks like moving forward, Ericsson and Nokia will supply T-Mobile with equipment. And in, in many cases, it's going to be new, modern equipment like you're seeing here with Nokia testing with Qualcomm. And then the new massive MIMO dual, uh, massive MIMO panel that you saw yesterday in the video that can do band 25 and band 66 with massive MIMO for higher capacity. So T-Mobile is continuing to leverage its 5G lead and now they're modernizing sites again. They're, they're adding newer equipment in Ericsson land, like you saw, again, like I said in the video, probably not going to big scale, but it's still going to help the individual sites that they deploy that on. And then this new technology that they're working with, the uplink transmit, that's probably going to be at, at deployed at wide scale. Not Probably not going to require new equipment or anything like that. This is just a software thing that they probably can do remotely. And it'll help boost uplink speeds significantly. So I'll just read this here briefly. The Uncarrier just shattered its own record by spearheading new technologies to boost your phone's uh, superpowers. T-Mobile today announced it, it achieved record-breaking uplink speeds of 345 megabits per second on its 5G standalone network in a recent test leveraging a new feature called ULTX, again, uplink transmit switching. That's the fastest ever recorded in North America using sub-6 gigahertz spectrum, and it, and it demonstrates the technology's potential to revolutionize the way data is transmitted from mobile, from mobile devices to the network. So this is interesting. This is T-Mobile continuing to, to stay ahead of the curve. They want to modernize. They want to be ahead of the competition. We got 5G Advance coming up at some point. T-Mobile's already, what, almost four years in now on the 5G deployment, so they will continue upgrading enhancing modernizing and testing and including technologies like these this uplink transmit that you're seeing in this article so i i fully expect ericsson has a similar solution so i don't expect them to be different different too much like from nokia having this and ericsson doesn't have it i don't see that being the case um, i see ericsson having a very similar technology i don't know if it'll be called the same but they probably have the same so we'll see when once this goes more widespread, how that helps to uplink. We'll definitely stay tuned for that. And make sure you guys like, share, subscribe. If you're new to the channel, follow my social media outlets. This is Tyrone with Tech Life. I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.